Have you ever wondered how the gaming benchmarking channels get this nice FPS counter? In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can monitor FPS and all the stats of any games. Hey what's up everyone, welcome back to Tech Trends. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you won't miss any future videos. So you just bought a new gaming PC or upgraded your old one and you wanna know how much FPS you're getting in games. In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to monitor FPS and all the stats in games. To show FPS in games, you need a software called MSI Afterburner. Don't worry, you don't need any MSI motherboard or graphics cards to use it. To download it, just search for MSI Afterburner on Google or go to the link in the description below. After the download is complete, install it. While installing, make sure you check this Install Revo Tuner Statistics Server option, otherwise it won't show the FPS on screen. When you're done with the installation, open the program. Don't worry, you don't have to overclock your graphics card to use this on-screen FPS. You can just leave everything as it is in here. Now click on the gear icon to go to the settings. From here, click on monitoring tab and from this list, select everything you wanna show on-screen and click on this show in on-screen display option. If you don't see it here, that means you didn't check the install Riva Tuner statistics server option when installing Afterburner. So install that and you'll see this option right here. Now I'll just select GPU temperature, GPU usage, memory usage, CPU temperature, CPU usage, RAM, and FPS. And when you're done selecting everything you want on the screen, click apply and ok. Now go to the taskbar and click on show hidden icons. From here, open this icon which is Riva Tuner Statistics Server. On the general properties, make sure show on display is on. And from here, you can change the color of on-screen display. Change the size and the position by clicking and dragging it on the box. When you're satisfied with your changes, close Revit Tuner and open any game. Now you can see the FPS and all the stats on screen while gaming. Hope this video helped you, like the video if you liked it, dislike if you did it. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this, have a great day and peace.